Tanya Delario is a former Croatian gymnast that had a very unique and particular style on the uneven bars. At this moment in time, she has two eponymous skills in the code of points, but you'll only find one of them in the table of elements. The other is actually sort of hidden in the appendices section of the code. However, there could have been a third. Recently on Twitter, a video resurfaced of Tanya training an element that never made it into the code. It's a Ginger-type release executed directly from a handstand position. Just like both of her eponymous skills, this one also has Tanya's trademark style. She executes them straight from a handstand on the bar. According to a user, the FIG did not want to encourage these types of moves back in the 2005-8 quad. This is probably why the release never entered the code, and her eponymous transition doesn't even have a technical drawing, only being featured in the appendices section. Both of her elements are extremely rare, and this could be attributed to multiple factors, like the two of them being valued at C, which is considered fairly easy for elite standards these days, and also the fact that connecting them to other elements might be particularly challenging since the handstand position must be precise and there's not a lot of momentum going into the skills. Nonetheless, all these elements are very unique and innovative, and could actually bring some originality to an apparatus that is almost becoming too formulaic and predictable. Do you think these types of elements should be encouraged?